It's here, part two of my oral collagen supplementation series. Let's talk about collagen supplements for anti-aging. So in this video today, I am revealing to you my top collagen pick that I use and recommend for my patients and now you guys here on YouTube. This is not sponsored. It is all my completely unfiltered opinion and my expert advice here. Now you all have been impatiently waiting this video part two of my oral collagen supplementation series. So check out part one to learn if collagen supplements are worth the hype and if they actually work for anti-aging. In that video, I refuted the myths around collagen supplements and the misconceptions. I told you exactly how collagen supplements can make it through your GI system and not get destroyed by your stomach acid and digestion and in fact, make it all the way to your skin. I also told you that collagen supplements aren't actually collagen at all. They are actually fragments of collagen and collagen building blocks that reform into a full mature collagen molecule once they make it to the organ that they are supposed to be helping, such as your skin, your hair, and your nails. The research on collagen supplements is fascinating. I really did a whole deep dive on this and it really is fascinating. There's a ton of studies there and the results for improving skin elasticity, hydration, fading fine lines and wrinkles are proven over and over in many of these studies. So check out part one for my full deep dive. I'm Dr. Marin Locke, if you're new here, I am known here as the budget dermatologist where I help make skincare simple and approachable for you. Subscribe to my channel and turn on the notifications so you never miss a video during its live premiere where I live chat with you all in that little chat box next to this video. It's the best and quickest way to get your questions answered by me. And hey, special shout out to those loyal followers who tune in and live chat every single week. I am starting to always recognize your names that I see often. You guys are the best. Now you can also follow me on Instagram at the budget dermatologist for more, you know, behind the scenes and just other fun skincare tips. So now you are ready to level up your skincare and wellness routine, right? You're amped up about adding in a collagen supplement. You know that they actually work. So what's stopping you? Probably you don't know what to buy because there are thousands of collagen supplements to choose from. Pure overwhelm in this situation can really stop us right in our tracks and make us kind of just do nothing or choose nothing, but not today. Here are my tips for sorting through the collagen supplements to make sure you are getting a quality option for your money and one that actually works and is safe. Now, what I am going to recommend in terms of the actual supplements that I am using and recommend are just my opinion based on my own research that I've done. Like I said, it's not sponsored. It's just what I have organically chosen, but it's not to say that these are the ones that you have to choose for yourself, but rather I am going to first give you my tips that I think you should follow when deciding for yourself, which of these supplements you're going to choose from. If you follow these tips, I think it will lead you to one that is also going to be very beneficial. But again, I'm going to do a little demo at the end of, several supplements. I'm going to mix them up for you, show you what they look like and give you some tips about using them. Okay. So first I'm going to start with my tips. Tip number one, understand all of the potential sources that you can get collagen. This way you can actually optimize your consumption and your results. So you have two main options to get your collagen. One, eat more whole food sources that contain collagen or two, take a collagen supplement in the form of a powder or a capsule of which there is a huge variety of these in terms of quality and effectiveness, which I'll get into now, hands down between these two options. What do you think is the best option? There really is no comparison that eating a real whole food source of collagen is the best and most bioavailable way to get more collagen into your body. It is superior to powders or pills, but unfortunately there are a lot of barriers to eating these whole food sources consistently every day for many people. So powders and pills are really 
actually a reasonable and effective option, and it's one that I choose for myself very often. Tip number two, understand where the collagen comes from in your supplement. There are two, really two main sources, bovine versus marine. From all the research I've done, I think that you can get benefit from either bovine or marine collagen, but some studies are suggesting that bovine is the most bioavailable for humans and therefore may be your best option for getting optimal results. And as a side note for this tip, I want to mention the quote unquote vegan collagen. I get asked about this a lot. There is no such thing as truly vegan collagen. Now, some scientists are working on genetically modifying things like yeast and bacteria to create an animal-free vegan collagen, but more research is needed on whether it delivers the same type of results as animal-based collagen products, and at the end of the day, it truly isn't collagen. Tip number three, go with a brand that is very transparent about how they source their collagen and how they process it. This is really crucial. Here are the things that you need to look for. If you are looking for a bovine source, you want a supplement that clearly states it is grass fed because this is going to produce the highest quality and most natural collagen supplement. If you are going to get a marine source, you want one that is sourced from wild caught fish to make sure there is a low heavy metal content. I think that you also have to be careful about this source if you are allergic to fish or shellfish, but read the labels very carefully and follow the directions. Next, you wanna choose a company that performs third-party testing on their products. This means an independent lab will continually monitor their products for contaminants like pesticides and glyphosate and hormones and antibiotics and other heavy metals like lead. Choose a company that has a process in place for a traceable supply chain. Meaning, if it comes from a bovine source, the collagen can be traced all the way back to the farm and the pasture where it was raised so that they can verify and test that these animals are raised and cared for in a way that produces the most quality supplement free of dangerous additives or contaminants. Tip number four, consider how the collagen is processed meaning how it is taken from the raw material animal source and converted all the way into the powder you get. Ideally, you will want a natural and pure raw form of collagen that can be processed into a supplement form without chemicals, with the use of just enzymes that break that protein down into the peptide fragments. This is going to give you the cleanest source. And don't worry, like I said, I'm rounding up ideal examples of collagen at the end. Just let me educate you here first in case you don't wanna get one of the ones I recommend. You can at least use these tips to go out and pick the best one for yourself. Tip number five, not all collagen supplements are created equally. This is my most important and interesting tip. For example, five grams of collagen in one of the products is not necessarily equal to five grams of collagen in another product. So you cannot compare two completely different brands by their collagen content alone and say which one is better. So which collagen supplement is best in terms of the source of collagen in it? First of all, please understand or remember from part one of the series that you are not taking in whole collagen proteins when you consume a supplement. Instead, you are consuming hydrolyzed collagen molecules, which are broken up parts or fragments of the larger protein. These can be amino acids or peptides. For my full review on this difference, check out part one. So as I was saying, not all fragments are equally effective. There is a specific type of collagen called varisol collagen, which consists of bioactive collagen peptides. So varisol collagen is thought to be a more effective and more concentrated version compared to regular collagen. And some supplements on the market contain this unique type of varisol collagen. Now varisol collagen is developed and made by Gelita, a company based in Germany. This collagen is grass-fed bovine derived for most of their supplements. There are some versions that are marine derived, but in the supplements that I take, it has bovine varisol. So Gelita makes this source of collagen and is a distributor of the collagen to different brands. 
there are several brands that I have found that use this as their collagen in their supplement. Now, what's fascinating about Verisol is that there are some really impressive results from clinical studies that show Verisol is more effective at improving skin elasticity, hydration, and reducing wrinkles compared to other forms of collagen peptides. These studies were done in a high quality manner. They are monocentric, double-blinded, randomized, placebo-controlled studies. And further, these results from these studies have been independently substantiated. And the improvements that they saw in these studies could be seen after just four weeks of consistent use. There are even studies showing improvement in cellulite reduction with just 2.5 grams of Verisol collagen daily. Now, I have been using regular collagen supplements initially, but then more recently, I have switched to brands that contain Verisol collagen because I've personally found this research to be very compelling. So enough of that, I'm about to take you with me right now to give you an inside look at the supplements that I am using. Okay, so here we are, about to give you a demo of my collagen supplements. Kind of looks like I'm about to do a cooking show and nobody needs that. Okay, so first up is the brand Sparkle Wellness. Disclaimer, this is about to sound very sponsored, like some people would maybe represent these. I bought everything I'm showing you myself. I found these all on my own. I was not approached by any of these brands. This is what I'm actually using and loving. I have these linked below. So this has Verisol bioactive collagen peptides as the source of collagen. It comes in two versions, the Skin Boost and the Skin Boost Plus, which I have here. The difference is the Skin Boost has 2.5 grams of collagen and this one has five grams of collagen, so twice as much. Now, if you were wondering what dose is best, the studies that I referenced earlier used 2.5 grams of Verisol collagen. So I think that at least that much is good. More is not always better with these types of things, but I can be a bit of an extremist sometimes when it comes to these types of things. So I use the Boost Plus um, with the double amount of collagen, five grams. Remember, five grams of Verisol collagen cannot be compared to some of these other brands that have like 15 and 20 grams. They're not the same form. This is more concentrated. So I have another quick tip to share with you. Tip number six, I think we're on. Look at the additives in the collagen supplement. First things first, you better be sure there is no sugar added in your supplement, like 0%. That is completely counterproductive for your health. Then you need to decide if you want something flavored or unflavored. If you choose a flavored one like this, these can have a natural sweetener in it, like stevia or monk fruit or something else similar. That should not add calories to your supplement. This one comes in a lot of flavors, and my favorite one is this one. It's the lemonade. I think it's like, it's acai lemonade. It's very good, and I also love the unflavored ones, depending what I am mixing in. So further along with this tip of additives, some supplements will contain things like vitamin C, zinc, and other kind of things that I call collagen builders. But please know that more than just amino acids are even needed to form collagen molecules. So supplements can add additional vitamins to ensure that your body has everything needed to optimally build new collagen. For example, vitamin C is a cofactor that's required to form collagen. So you can have all the building blocks in the world, but if you don't have vitamin C in your body, bioavailable, ready to go, then you're not gonna make collagen. This one by Sparkle Wellness has vitamin C in it and hyaluronic acid. If you take hyaluronic acid orally, it can improve collagen synthesis and help your skin retain moisture. But a disclaimer, I have not done a deep dive on oral hyaluronic acid, so I won't speak in depth about that right now, but hyaluronic acid is in this product. So I consider this a super clean, give you a little look at it here, super clean product. It's free from GMOs, artificial ingredients, no sugar, no gluten, it's dairy-free, soy-free, so it has a very low risk of allergen issues with this product. Now for me, the unflavored goes in my coffee, the flavored I mix with cold water and then take it on the go, so kind of either or what I am doing with my routine that day is which one I'll choose of these. Now one of the really big icks about collagen powders is that they really can clump, but some formulations are made to avoid that clumping. 
but I still find that you really have to shake the heck out of them to get out the clumps, which is just, you have to get out the clumps if you are going to be able to drink and enjoy this type of supplement. So what I do is actually use a frother to mix the powder in my water. It literally takes a few seconds and it blends seamlessly with zero clumps. I'll link the one below that I am using. So I'll show you that in just a second. So that is the first brand that I wanted to recommend and tell you guys about. I'm going to mix it up and kind of show you it in a second. But I want to tell you that this brand, from what I know, is super transparent company. They are a plastic to zero commitment, high quality ingredients. They follow all of those tips I mentioned earlier, like grass fed, um, traceable supply chain. This is a unique brand because they have a great variety of flavors to choose from. It's available on Amazon. And like I said, I've linked these below. Okay, so here's my demo of the Sparkle Wellness. This is the flavored one, the Acai Lemonade. So I'm gonna show you this one first. I use these bottles and I mix it in here and take these on the go with me. These are amazing. They are from Amazon. I'm gonna link these below too. So just one scoop of this. Let me show you here. And then I'll show you how I use my frother. Or I'm gonna show you how I, I just shake it up to begin with at first and how it's really hard to get it to dissolve quite easily as it is with a frother. So put that back here and let me shake it up for you first so you can kind of see what I'm talking about. Still, actually that looks really good. There's a little bit, oh yeah, no, you can't really see it, but there's still kind of a big clump up at the top. So you can shake and shake and shake and eventually this can kind of get homogenized and more smooth, but if you don't have time for that and you are really sensitive to that texture and that taste, get a frother. These are amazing. So I stick it right in and just go for it. The reason I love these is because it's really well, the frother just goes right down in there and just a few seconds, you're all set to go. So that is that Aussie flavored one. So when you taste it, It's just a really subtle, nice, refreshing lemonade type flavor. Really love this one. Honestly, of all of the ones that I'm going to show you, this is the most enjoyable one for me and the one that I will have no problem getting into my daily routine. So that is this one. So now for the unflavored one, I put it in coffee because even though it's unflavored, these can still have this subtle flavor and a little bit of texture to it that if you are sensitive to that, you probably won't enjoy it. So into coffee it goes. These are the cutest coffee mugs. I will link these below. I just love these, so cute. So, okay, this is what this one looks like. White, unflavored. Same thing, I'll just take a little scoop of this you can see first coffee little scoop into there it goes this aside and then i again will use my frother for the coffee i like these bigger cups because it doesn't spill when i do the frother at high speed okay so that is that, just making a mess here. This is literally what I'm like in the kitchen. So that's why nobody wants to see this. Okay, and this looks like here, regular coffee. Taste test. You cannot taste it in coffee. Again, um, okay, this is what I'll show you. This is actually my water from earlier that I held up at the beginning of the video. This is, plain water that has this mixed in it. And you can see it's clear, but the taste, it is unflavored, but the taste, it just doesn't taste unflavored. There, it's hard to explain. If you know, you know. Um, and there's just the slightest smell to it too, which to some people, again, if you're just sensitive about this whole thing, I would not recommend the unflavored and pure water. Go with a hot beverage like coffee. One more appreciation for these super 
cute mugs. Oh, my son is on the back. Check out this one. I got this since they're so much older now. These are so cute. I'm going to link these below. Now these are going away and I'm about to show you a newer product that I have tried more recently and am fascinated by it. Now, this is a newer to market collagen, but it's by a well-known brand. Like I said, fascinated with this product, but wait, when I say this brand, it's not what you think. So hear me out. It's by Vital Proteins. Again, not sponsored, not sponsored, but it's not this. This is not what I'm talking about. This is great and all, and I have actually used this many times, but this is not what I am recommending now. Instead, it's this Vital Proteins Professional. Did you guys know they came out with this new line? So this classic option hits all of my requirements when picking out a collagen supplement. This is high quality. It is a transparent source of collagen. It has that same chemical free processing, no sugar additives. This has simple ingredients. It has collagen, hyaluronic acid and vitamin C. So it's actually very similar to this product by Sparkle Wellness in that respect, except for the collagen source. But you will notice that this has a higher gram uh, percentage or grams of collagen than this one because this one has varisol collagen, which is very concentrated. So you cannot compare the grams of this to the grams of this as if they are equal apples to apples comparison. So just to clarify, but with the Vital Proteins Professional, this is what I think is more interesting here. The collagen in this is varisol collagen from Jalita, the same company that supplies the collagen for this. So they source their collagen from the same place that Sparkle Wellness sources there. So I consider these two very equivalent. So this product line, I actually have two. I have this for my husband and this for me. So this product line is based on the overwhelming research behind Verisol and bioactive collagen peptides and just how powerful this can be for anti-aging. There, like I said, there's three options in the Vital Proteins Professional line. This one, the daily foundational support and the bone and joint support. So I am recommending the skin hydration option, which contains Verisol five grams. Again, the same as the Boost Plus, five grams in here as well. This also contains liposomal pure whey C, which is supposed to be this highly absorbed form of vitamin C. It has hyaluronic acid, lactobacillus to optimize your gut and microbiome and support your skin's immune function. And it has antioxidants to protect your skin from those environmental stressors. Now this is more expensive than the blue container, but I do think this is worth the price. Okay, so taste test for this one. So I don't know how to get this camera angle, so this is just what we're going with. So Vital Proteins Professional, skin hydration and antioxidant support. This is unflavored, but you can see what's a little bit different about this is like the color variation. So those are lycobeads. They are the lactobacillus things that increase your gut and microbiome like protection. So same thing, I'm just going to get little scoop that I put in here. Again, I'm linking these bottles below from Amazon. They're just so great for on the go and for mixing supplements and all of that good stuff. So here we go there and you can shake it up. It's fine. Or you can use this awesome frother. So a couple seconds and this blends in extremely nicely. You are going to see that this actually has a little bit of a pink to hue like pink color to it it's not flavored but that's the antioxidants in it and you can see those little lyco beads there again this is unflavored here's our taste test really good it has a subtle difference in flavor than just regular water but it's really really easy to drink i think that i even like this unflavored one probably a little bit better than the sparkle wellness unflavored one but this is going to mix really well in water and hot beverages so this is an awesome one like i said check out their other proteins uh, professional line one too this also has varisol in it but a couple other things kind of 
you know, if you guys are curious about it, again, um, drop your questions and comments below. So this is the Vital Proteins Professional. So this brings me to my last tip. Take your personal preference into account. Whether you want a flavored or unflavored option, take into account how it mixes into the beverage of your choice. How do you feel after you use it for four weeks? What are your results? These will all be unique to you. And sometimes skincare and wellness at the end of the day is just kind of a trial and error thing. There are no guarantees. I know that you all are going to have more questions after this. So how about this? I am seeing, if I am seeing a lot of similar questions in the comments or coming across in my messages on Instagram, I'll do a follow-up part three collagen Q and A. So comment below with your questions for that. And if you guys try any of these supplements, comment below and let us know what you all think. Now is a great time to subscribe. Turn on those notifications so you can come live chat with me during my video premieres and come follow me on Instagram at The Budget Dermatologist for more skincare made simple content. See you next time.